Uh, county police are at my house here in Lansing County yet again. <sighs> Can I help you? Yeah, tough lift is happy ass out here. It's not here. I rent this place. I've told them that. Sure thing. Sure thing. You want to see? Well, again? Well. And again? Yeah. And again? How many times sure, do you want to see? Uh, Stephanie Lowell will help you. How's that? Well, he's not helping me. He's being a pain in my ass. Hold on. <clears throat> you know, just keep keep on coming here. Here, the gate's over here. You want to come in? You want to look again? I cut the, uh, ended up taking bolt cutters from the damn lock on the back last time. Figured you guys would be back so I could show you what's up with the dog poop. I I have all dog, you guys have all my fucking dogs. What do you mean? You had all those pups. What happened to them? I stopped, remember I stopped you in 10 you had like six in the front of your car. You don't know what happened to them? You guys came and took them when I went to the store. And then when I, I, I called up and I was going to pay to get them back, uh, they said it was $25 per dog plus $5 per, uh, per dog per day. Huh? When you were living here? No, not here. I didn't have them here. Idaho. They took them before I moved here. I, I cut the lock so that I could get into the shop so y'all could see last time for you guys to be right back. But you, now I gotta fix the door. I took a pry bar and, and first I tried cutting it, it didn't work. Anyways, it's unlocked now. I, I look, you realize this is, Clint, this is Clint's listed residence with probation, correct? Yeah, it's not supposed to be. That's what he's got listed. So okay. he changes it. Well, he couldn't get anything changed because he was supposed to get things changed over to Lassen County. And his probation officer, whoever was supposed to be there for him to sign the paper, he went there five times, called the guy, told him he was on his he way. He went to probation five times? Yes. They, the guy would not be there five times. I even called him. I, I got to record it. He called the guy and said, I'm on my way. Are you going to be there this time? Five times. He drove from here to Alturas. And then the guy, oh, he just stepped out. He's not here. You know, every single time. And then they turn around and violate him on a probe on, uh, Violation, uh, violating him on parole, whatever the hell that is. And it's bullshit because he was trying and he went there. We can't afford the gas for him to do that. And he had seizures. He shouldn't even be driving. The asshole fucking kept not being there. And he called him ahead of time and, and set it up. The guy said he'd be there every time. Now he can't even be home. Now he has to be out, out wherever in the hell he's hiding. This wasn't his home. Huh? It, it was, but it can't be because you guys won't leave him alone. I mean, he's dying of fucking cancer, and you guys can't just leave him alone. I'm, well, I'm sorry, I'm pissed. Him? Why don't we go check him with probation and explain that to him? He went in there five different times I to sign that paper. I, I so, got it recorded. You want to see the evidence? And so now he's now he's off. Uh, he, from his warrant. He's out he in the would woods. Have a ten-day violation. He shouldn't have a 10-day violation. He shouldn't have to go back to jail. He shouldn't have been there in the first place. It was his four-wheeler, and his attorney has the proof. His attorney has the title. And, and all the paperwork on that fucking four-wheeler showing he had it for 20 years. Well, then why did he lose in court? Because his attorney refused to show the paperwork. Right. And because the judge wouldn't let him change attorneys. You can find it hard to believe. I have evidence. Let's not sit you want to see it? Let's just move along so that we can get out of your I'll head. show you evidence. What, what do you want to look at? You guys want to look in the shop again? I, like okay. I said, I, I, I ripped the... Uh, the door opened last time because I, you guys were over here and I figured you'd be back. And then once you guys actually breaking, breaking shit, I wanted to break in the way that I could. Oh, we gotta go through the door. We can come back around to that. If you're worried, somebody can watch that door. I don't care. But we can go through here and come back around. Or I can walk through and open it for you. However, I don't know how you guys open shit and destroy shit. No plan. Just my workshop. I'm trying to get his stuff cleaned up. And organize. Maybe you can get enough money to can rent a place away from you guys. Before he fucking dies fucking in the woods. <sighs> oh, that's the. Yeah, go ahead. That's the door that. It's just locked on the inside. I makeshifted a lock there. Because I had to break it. And y'all didn't even shut back up. He should be able to be home. But he can't be. He should be going to the hospital. But he can't be. Why can't he go to the hospital? Well, okay, he won't when he's not at home. I guess he can't 
I guess it's not. I can't go to the hospital. hospital. I know. That's not, well, you guys did for, what, almost a year? And does cancer go from stage one to, uh, to, to inoperable? What kind of cancer has he got? He has, it's in his, uh, it's back in his bones again, and it's in his kidneys now. He had, uh, he had beat it back in 2011. So Anyways. You know he didn't die out in the woods huh? How do you know he didn't die out in the woods somewhere? Well, uh... I I talked to him occasionally. Uh, the, in between, I don't know. Last time I seen him, he was having seizures so bad he couldn't breathe. Where was that at? I can't tell you where, but it was in here. I can tell you that. So you're you're assisting him. What you're saying? I'm not assisting because uh, where he was is and where he is. He was. We have met up. I don't want to know where he is, so I don't have to, to lie to y'all. And I told him that. I don't want to know. What else do you want to see? You guys already go through the house? You want to look in the motorhomes? You want to look in the fucking the RV? How many more times are you guys going to come here? The one that needs to be arrested is the asshole probation officer that, that should have been there when he said he was going to be. Five times. One time, okay. Two times, you know, that, that's, that's pushing it a little bit. Five times, you want to see the evidence or you, or you just want to believe what you want to believe? I thought you guys said that was your job, was to look at forensic evidence. I can show you evidence. I can show you every call he made. I can show you, even on Google Map, have it, have it track, track and show that he went there. Where is he? Huh, when, I was talking about when you went to uh, to probation five different times. Yeah. No, not nobody was that there. The guy, the guy that w was supposed to be there wasn't. Even though he called him ahead of time, said, "I'm on my way. Are you gonna be there?" And then the guy wouldn't be there. Kind of like when you guys were hiding times. in the attic of Clint's shop. No, that was different. That was crazy. No, that was different. That's different. That, no, oh, okay. that wasn't him trying to go in on He's probation. That was me trying to. Black hoodies driving. He doesn't have a red car with a black hood. Well, Whose car is it? Uh, Bobby Simmons, I think, was Bobby uh, Simmons? Th that was years, two years ago that I know for sure he owned it. I don't know who owns it now. Oh. Uh, him and Melissa Walters used to drive it around. I don't know who has it now. Oh. Uh, but Clint drives it from time to time? No, Clint and Bobby don't even get along. I've never seen Clint drive that car. Matter of fact, Bobby's not even allowed around I didn't his house. I asked you if seen him drive it. I asked you when the last time he drove it was. I, as far as I know, he's never driven it. Ever. I know if you're worrying about well, who's running around stealing, I'd say uh, my guess. My guess. Uh, no, I have a guess. Let's see. Okay. Uh, hear this. My this guess. Well, be, based on the simple fact that the stealing stopped when he went away and started when he came back, Chris Kiefer's back in town. And uh, since he's been back, my stuff from my house has been stolen. Stuff from Clint's house has been stolen. It's been stolen from your house. From my house? Uh, just uh, some tools and, and like different things. Uh, a saw, um, uh, uh, air compressor uh, thing that actually was broke didn't work. Um, my daughter's uh, parts off my daughter's motor, uh, the Subaru that I got in her, and Clint was you fixing. Didn't report it. What good does it do? Last time I tried reporting things stolen to you guys, you never even took the report. Go ahead. You guys, you guys don't investigate. Uh, when I first moved here, my generator was stolen. I called you guys over and over, and, and nobody would even come out and take the report. You laughed That's at me. No bullshit. I got that on was tape, too. Your house every other day. Huh? Button was out at your house every other day. When I very first moved here. Yeah, Button. I don't know who Button is. Yeah, you do. Well, I, I don't know him by that name. Huh? I don't know him by that name. What'd you say? Uh, Something. Valid in the pickup not yeah, I'm getting. Yeah, I uh, I got a paper that I'm filling out for our. I have to fill out for a DMV and basically re-register it because it's been so long. So it doesn't have any. It's not registered. <laughs> yeah, uh, I got a paper with the DMV. That she no, said no, I have to re no, no. get I it re-registered. No, no, uh, but now I, I found out how. Of paper right now. No, no, I found out how I can do it. It took me a while to figure out how the hell I could do it because it hasn't been registered for so long to get it transferred. Um, you don't have. A Insurance on that either? Uh, we're not at the moment. No. Oh, that's awful. I know it is. It sucks. It's fortunate. It, it makes it fucking hard. County right now, and I really don't want to go to Lassen County Court. Cool. Well, I appreciate so that. The second it crosses into Modoc County and we see it, uh huh. Consider it gone. It's going bye bye. Uh huh. It's going straight to the tow yard. I hear you. Okay. I'm trying my damn just to get it registered. I'm living off of I not very much. I don't care what you're trying to do. I'm telling you what I am going to do. I hear you. Thank okay. you. Okay, good.
So when Clint comes home tonight, you tell him we were looking for him, okay? Well, like I said, he's not staying here. I wish no. he could. Come on, I really wish he could be. You know what? No, I don't play games, sir. Yes, you do. You absolutely do. No, I don't. I, I find it childish and ridiculous. It's falling out of your mouth the last time we were looking at for him. And he, no, last time I and told you he had just we left. we found you and him up in the attic. That was, oh, um, <laughs> no, no, no. The last time yes, when you yes, guys yes. had showed up okay. and we're destroying okay. the place, okay, I told you if you wait a little next bit, time. he had just left and he was going to be next back time. later that day. Not here. I told Never you. Here. We catch not, you with him. not here, he's not. we catch you with him, you're going with him. No, no, no. Okay. No, the last time when you found me in the attic, I had left you're going because I was tired of the harassment. We both had left you understand and me? was trying to move out of the There's fucking two area. understand today. Yes. Don't drive your truck in Modoc County. It'll go okay. to the tow yard never to come back out. Sounds good. Yeah, like you took okay. my other car. Second it was thing. registered. When you get caught with Clint, uh -huh. you're going to jail with him. That's uh, an accessory. Okay? Fabulous. Awesome. Have a great night, Tia. Tell me I said hi. Kiss my ass. Okay. Love you, too. I got a promise for you. I will get you guys for harassment. You can't keep it with it up with this corrupt bullshit. This is America, you motherfucker. I will. That's a promise. I'll have my day in court, and it won't be me. It won't be me that's defending myself. It's coming, dude. Fifth time, sixth time, how many fucking more times? Cocksuckers. Oh, I'm sick of it. For all that don't know, it's pretty much everybody. The incident he was talking about was two incidences. One time, which I'm trying to find the video for that. Fucking trying to find the video for that. I actually got them admitting their corruptness on that fucking video, but that phone got broke. And, and I, yeah, anyways, go figure. Anyways, they showed up, and my friend Clint had just left. A friend of his picked him up to come out and help him get his vehicle out of the woods. Officers show up in mass looking for Clint. I told him he had just left. But I would let them know that he was looking for him, uh, that they were looking for him, or if they wanted to come back later that evening, he would be there at that time. No, they destroyed the whole fucking place. And I'd leave because obviously he wasn't fucking there. Excuse my language. But the next, after that, I ended up, I, I just told Glenn, you know, the rest, I'm walking around pacing, I'm so fucking mad. Oh, stop pacing, dear. Oh. Anyways. The last time, or the next time he's talking about when he found us up in in the attic in uh, in Clint's shop, we had left the area because we were so sick of the harassment, you know, like daily, like driving by our house and spotlighting at two o'clock in the morning. I, I I couldn't leave my yard without getting pulled over, or you know, just. To, I got pulled over for moving a snake out of the road. And there was no traffic on a country road. I got yanked out of my car by my feet because my uh, my registration had a piece of uh, a tape on the, the license plate. Okay? Um, <laughs> anyways. Yeah. So we left out of the area and we were trying to find an attorney. Any attorney that would take this place on. And, uh... We were gone out here, I don't know, about six months, and, and you know, being poor, we didn't find, find the attorney we needed. 
um, he came back to his house to try to get some some more of his stuff and get some more of his paperwork to try to prove our case that he had left there at the house. And, yeah, the officers showed up, and, yeah, he ended up hiding in the attic. We were both tired of being beat up the last time we had encountered them. I had been slammed into the, the ground and, and ended up with, like, rocks embedded in my legs and knees, and he got tased in the chest preemptively in case he tried to help me, even though he was already cuffed and wasn't fighting them. And he has a, a health condition as it is, as do I. Um, I have a, a heart condition. And anyways, uh, yeah, all I did was say that they didn't have, uh, I didn't give them my permission to go through and destroy my vehicle that they pulled us over because they said that Clint's um, license was suspended. Which it wasn't, they just refused to release it. He had already paid all the court fines and all the DMV fines. And, you know, he had already done all of that. And, but Modoc County refused to lift the suspension off of the record. And so, yeah, and anyways, now I'm just ranting. I'm so mad. I'm so fed up with this. And I don't know what the fuck to do. There's no justice. Modoc County, California. Alters Sheriff's Department. Gotta love them.